You're probably wondering how much do software engineers make? If you're considering a career as a programmer, it's important to understand the salary ranges and the career trajectory of a software engineer. So let's begin. As you might imagine, three important factors that contribute to your salary are your location, years of experience, and the size of the company. Let's talk about your location. The supply and demand of programmers, web developers, and software engineers in your city will be the most important factor of how much you can earn as a software engineer. According to a report on Hired.com, an average software engineer's salary is around 135000 in the U.S. in 2019. As with all averages, you have to be very careful. An average engineering salary in San Francisco is 145,000, but it will be much lower in cities that aren't the main tech hubs like Columbus, Ohio, where the average salary according to Glassdoor is only 68,000. In general, as a developer with several years of experience, you could expect to make over six figures in major metropolitan cities like New York, Atlanta, Austin, Chicago, and LA. If you live in smaller towns with cheaper cost of living, most of the employers are likely to be web development shops or small businesses, so they will likely pay between 60 to 80,000 a year. The next factor is years of experience. If you're a junior engineer, you likely earn 60 to 70 percent of the averages I shared above. So if you're in San Francisco, your starting salary will be around 100,000. If you're in New York, Atlanta, Chicago, it will likely be between 65 and 80,000. And if you're in smaller cities or towns, the junior engineering salaries will range between 50 to 70,000 per year. The good thing is, once you have one or two years of experience under your belt, you can start interviewing with companies and quickly catch up to the averages. The last factor that will contribute to your salary is the size of the company. A popular question I get asked is, how much do software engineers make at Google? If you're working with a big tech company, a junior software engineer can make 135,000 salary plus stock with a compensation between 180 and 200,000 a year. Now, getting a job at Google, Facebook, Netflix, and Tesla as your first engineering job is very challenging, but not impossible. You want something? Go get it. Period. In fact, I recently helped our career karma interns get jobs at Tesla, Instacart, and Walmart Labs. It's more likely, though, that you will get your first job at a startup. Startups typically will pay a lower base salary, but will give you options or equity in their company, which could be worth lots of money in 10 years if the company has an IPO or gets acquired. Now, nine out of the 10 startups fail, so I wouldn't be banking too much on the equity portion. The big advantage of working for a startup is being able to work on interesting projects from the ground up and getting a broad range of experience while you're still learning. As you're researching salaries, my advice is to factor in the cost of living because rent, groceries, transportation, and taxes will make a huge difference in how much you could save. In the Hire.com report that adjusted for cost of living, the cities that came out on top are actually Austin, Chicago, Seattle, and Denver. Now that you know how much software engineers can make, watch my other video on how to become a software engineer, where I break down how I learned to code and got a job as a developer and eventually became the CTO of Career Karma. If you enjoyed this video, comment below which city you think has the highest salary adjusted for cost of living. Let's break in.